So many people don't know this, but Donghui has a really awesome beach. There's barely any foreign tourists here. That's the ocean view right there. Donghui. I I keep I don't know I keep forgetting the name of this beach town. Donghui? No, it's it's not Donghui. I've been saying Donghui all these years, I know I'm wrong. It's not Donghui. Donghui. Donghui? So after the trip, especially at the end, uh, the last trek uphill was extremely painful. It was very difficult. And so my legs were just done. I had so much pain in my knees, I couldn't even bend them properly. I couldn't even walk, I couldn't even go down steps. I couldn't even take off my pants or put them on. Uh, the pants that I wore to dinner, I just wore them to sleep because I just couldn't take them off. That's how much pain I was in. And a lady at this restaurant we ate at, she was ordering food to go, she noticed my agony. And she asked me, oh, what's up? What happened? You know, yeah, I just went to a cave. And she says, oh, you should take some medication. And I said, yeah, I don't know which one. You know, I don't know where the pharmacy is. Uh, I can't walk there. Um, and I don't have any money because I spent all my money and gave them to the, give tips to the, the tour guides and the porters. And she's like, okay. And about maybe 10, 15 minutes later, I get a tap on my shoulders and, and I see, I see this. She, she, she went out and, and bought me um, some medicine, uh, anti-inflammatory. People in this area, Mingjung people, are so kind, so nice. I truly believe they're the nicest people in Vietnam. I want to show you over the course of uh, today and tomorrow what uh, Dong Hoi, Dong Hoi, Dong Hoi, it's not Dong Hoi. Dong. Oh, I'm I'm so frustrated that I cannot get the name of this place correctly. Dong. Hang on. Hang on. Dong. Dong hơi. Dong hơi. Hơi I'm gonna show you what Dong hơi is like. So our driver Sheng recommended that we try Ban Lok and Ban Nao. I've had this before in Hue many years ago, probably in Southern California as well, but he says that it's a specialty in this city. You have to get the gelatinous gooey part really done right. There's some scallions, there's some pork, there's... But the shrimp, it's not just any shrimp, it's a shrimp with a shell that they probably pre-soaked in something because it's very flavorful. It's very, very like dark uh, and meaty. Um, each one is 2,500 dong. You need to eat 10 to make about a dollar. That's freaking cheap. Ooh, it looks so good. Oh man, Ooh, I'm drooling, I'm drooling. Mm. Looking at Axel, open it up. This one looks really good. Mm. 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 Can you feel it in your blood? I feel on my blood. <laughs> mm. mm. wow. So this is the Nhat Le Bridge. Dong Hoi is connected. And this is the other, another beach. And look at the construction, guys. Look, look what they're building, look at that. Look at what they're building there, wow. Nhưng mà em thích biển nào hơn Nhật Lê hay Bảo Ninh? Nhật Lê, Bảo Ninh đều có hai bài nó nó đóng hết chứ. Nhưng mà cái này, cái nào để với em cái nào đẹp hơn? Ờ bên ạ, Bảo Ninh cũng được đẹp đẹp hơn ạ. I think definitely this beach is nicer wow. than Nhật Lê. I think it's nicer. Maybe over there is a resort maybe, but uh, I mean it's beautiful here. So many so beaches beautiful. like these all over Vietnam that people don't know about. I am, and, and uh, especially here is no tourism, man. It's crazy. There will be. I don't know if we're supposed or even allowed to be on this road, but we're here, and, uh, <laughs> and we're here. <laughs> Thank you.
Okay, so we find ourselves at a new beach. We keep getting more and more remote. This is called Dancing Rua Da Nye'i Beach. And here's the kitchen right here. The grill. Here are the tables. And I'll show you the dancing rock in a bit, but let's eat some seafood first. Okay, first things out, this thing, this whole plate is only a hundred thousand dong. That's four dollars and thirty something cents. Okung is my favorite. I think it's called Babylonian snails in English. Usually these are the size of your fingernail, but here they're huge. Some of the biggest I've seen ever. Babylonian snails, Okung. Oh. Yeah, you want this part right here. That's the best part. Wow. And next up, we have some shrimp, some prawns straight from the ocean. Yeah, that one right there. Mid-sized ones, but I always like to eat the top part with, with the shell a little bit. See, like that? And the guts and stuff like that, that's the best part. Nếu mà không có nhờ anh á, là em không biết về cái biển này dạ. Và rất nhiều người không biết về biển này Tại vì bấm lên Google hay gì ở đâu À, nó không hiện ra Nó không hiện ra, mình nếu mà bấm ra đá nhảy hay gì đâu, đâu hiện ra Đâu biết đâu, đâu ít à, Em nghĩ là ít khi nào người nước ngoài mà được à, đi tham quan chỗ này Tại vì họ không biết luôn Không biết Nó không biết Và ở đây là hải sản giá Đấy. rất ok tươi, tươi ngon Tươi ngon, rất ok Và muốn yên tĩnh, không có du lịch It's right here My knees are still kind of in a lot of pain, so going down steps is kind of difficult, guys, right now for me. What the heck, man? Come on, guys. Come on. This behind me, around me, is definitely one of the most beautiful rocky beach shorelines I've ever seen. Unfortunately, there's a lot of trash here. It's very disappointing. Look at that tree growing on a rock, but... Oh, that's disappointing. That's really disappointing. Very unfortunate. Look, somebody left a barbecue here that's rusted. Wow, yeah, but wow, wow, look at that house. So, the driver tells me that this neighborhood we're heading back, by the way, used to be very poor, but uh, a lot of people moved abroad and sent money back home. So, they call areas like this Lang Seoul, Seoul Village, meaning that a lot of the daughters went to Korea. Send money back. This is also a little bit surprising to me, but uh, well, Oliver's back for today. This is uh, another day, by the way. Uh, and we are at a pine forest. Oh my god. Ah. 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 I feel very uh, comfortable and natural uh, amongst all these ducks. Maybe it's because of all the balut I've been eating. But uh, it's actually fun, you know. I'd, I'd love to raise ducks. Some people raise chickens. I'd love to raise ducks, actually. This road behind me here used to be an airport runway. Yeah, planes would land here. American planes. Now it's just a road. So we're approaching the end of the road right here and then the road extends. See, look, ah, right here, look, it's very clear. It's very clear that this is the new road right here. So we drive to this place. It looks like somebody's house and they're taking a nap. We're trying to find a restaurant, but it looks like we're just at somebody's house. Ah, East Hill. Ah, oh my God. 
Hello. 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 Oh, it smells so good. Well, this restaurant definitely has a view. <laughs> wow, look at this. They built a platform and then you just eat in one of these little huts. We actually got chicken. Oh. This is also the specialty in the Central Highlands as well. We had something like this in the last number. The meat is very tough, but it's very flavorful. Very sweet. But very tough. When you're eating periodically, you'll hear a drill sound. It's not construction. It's your food coming. <laughs> they put a drill into this. They made this machine. The local chicken, the Vietnamese call it gà ta, meaning our chicken. But the western chicken, they don't say gà tay because gà tay is a turkey. So the western chicken that we're thinking of, the ones in the factory, are actually called gà công nghiệp. Oh, you don't chew the bones on the ground? No, no, I, <laughs> no, I don't do that. No, no, my, bo my bones are in my bowl, by the way. All right, we're going to wrap up this meal here. But there's a few more things to see here in Quang Binh. Actually, this video started off being a Dong Hoi video and now it's turning into a Quang Bun video because we ran out of things to do in Dong Hoi. I love their bathroom. Check this out. It's like a houseplant collection. Does that say Monrovia? Is that Monrovia from California? Yep, I don't know how it's here. But uh, I love this next to the toilet but look what it says look what it says here please don't pee on the plants love it awesome bye 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 come on bye. son bye son yeah. bye son all right guys thank you so much for watching this video i have to catch a flight i'm a little bit late uh, if you enjoyed this video, do leave me a comment down below and give me a thumbs up. We're going to go back to Saigon and uh, let's see what happens there. <laughs> but thank you for watching this. Again, I've been Kyle. This has been Dong Hei. I'm finally getting it right, I hope. There's a lot to see in this province. And I hope if you ever get a chance to go to Phong Nha, do stop by for a day or two in Dong Hei. Hei! Because there's a really nice beach, and the people are nice, and the chicken. Actually, the chicken's in Phong Nha. Anyways, this is a great province. <laughs> Bye for now.